Okay, so welcome everybody to the WCCDI orientation. WCCDI is scheduled to start July 26th, which is next Monday for high school students. Hey, Ella. And July 27th for our middle school debaters. Agenda for today. Goals of camp, the topic, resolve. The United States federal government should substantially increase its protection of water resources in the United States. That is our topic for our high school debaters. For our middle school debaters, they will be talking about, hold on one second. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Middle school debaters will be discussing the United States should accede to the UN Convention on the Law of the Sea without reservations. So you guys will get a mouthful of what to expect. And as you see, there are two different styles of debate for high school and middle school with our bottle league. And I know we have some of our other leagues here, but at least for bottle, there will be, and all of you guys are welcome, but the middle school camp will be public forum style debate. And all of our high school debaters will be doing policy debate. Okay. Next slide. The goals of our camp are connecting as a community, uniting three leagues to bring a variety of participants together. We're gonna have optional events in the evening to help you guys build community. So because we have such a big group of debaters from all across the state of California, we're gonna have some events in the evening that you're able to pick and choose from that you would like to participate in. We ask that you be open-minded to the debate experience. And now to meet the staff. So lab leaders and staff, you have Brooke Kimbrell, Devin Cooper, Gabriela Gonzalez, Jasmine Pickens, Joseph Barkin, Leah Villanueva, um, Joelle Lemuel, me, Maya Whitaker, Santa, Lucia, Santa Lucia Hernandez, and Saya Abney and others. So I know a couple of these names you might be familiar with, others not so much, but you can look up everybody and they've got a background in debate and come with a lot of experience. So this is Dr. Burns. His pronouns are he, him, and his. Dream job, would love to be a DJ. Dr. Burns is also on this call. What's up, Dr. Burns? Hey. Novice Lab leaders for Novice Lab 1, we have Saya Abney. Pronouns are they and them. Favorite sport is sumo wrestling. Novice 2 Lab leaders. So we have Santa Lucia, who's going to go by Lucia Hernandez. Pronouns are she, her, and is. She, her, and hers. She loves tacos. Then we have Norma Delgado. She and her and have two pet cockatiels. We're Novice Lab, Carlos C. and Jonathan leading. For our JV Lab leaders, we have Joseph B. His pronouns are he and his. And we have Gabriella. Her pronouns are she and her. Leah Villanueva is she and her pronouns. And we have Brooke, who goes by Brooke. JV Lab 3 is going to be led by Vontrez White, whose pronouns are he, him, and his. And then Jared Burke, whose also pronouns are he, him, and his. Varsity Lab, so all of you that will be in Varsity. Um, Jasmine Pickens is going to be she and her pronouns. And Devin Cooper is he, him. Our second Varsity Lab is going to be led by Diego Flores. Pronouns are he and him and Joel Linwell, which is pronouns are he and him as well. For our middle school lab, again, just adding that in there, the middle school lab will be led by Sakai Bardell, who is a bottle staff and Willene Turner. So you guys will be pretty familiar with these faces that will be leading middle school lab. If you were curious, middle school debaters, again, will be led by Sakai Bardell and Willene Turner for that four days of camp. So now we're gonna to go to the community guidelines. Guidelines of participation. 
Be ready to actively listen and engage, commu communicate your needs, treat everyone with respect, respect the online space, and we have no tolerance for discriminatory language and behavior. If you are impacted by that, please let one of the staff know immediately. Guidelines for the get the most out of camp. So how do you do your best at camp? Turn your camera on during our meetings. Stay caught up. It's okay. Stay caught up, but communicate when you're not. So it's okay if you know you can't make it to a class or you're going to miss a session. We completely understand. Please let us know so we can support you in becoming the best debater you can for your scrimmages. Be ready to actively listen and engage. So, you know, try to limit the distractions around you. You can't watch TV and do debate camp. It's going to be really difficult. You know, try to get yourself in a good space where you can really participate and get the most of it. Be aware, be sensitive. So no, everybody has different, different backgrounds on this call. We've all been at different levels of debate and interested in this camp. So be patient with people, be open that they might not have the same experiences as you do introducing into debate. The schedule. So our schedule days and dates. High school's camp dates are Monday, July 26th to Saturday, July 31st, 2021. The general schedule, schedule Monday through Friday is going to be 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. a morning session. Then it's going to be a campwide assembly from 10 a.m. to 10.30 with morning check-ins happening Tuesday through Friday from 10 a.m. to 10.15. So that just lets us, you know, discuss with you how you're doing, how you're feeling, what did you get from the day before, what do you need help with. Then we're gonna have a break and you're gonna get an afternoon session. You're gonna get a break at 12 for lunch, of course. We can hang out in the chat, discuss anything with friends, you know, hang out. And then at one o'clock, we're gonna go back to class with our afternoon sessions. And that's gonna run from one to three. And then, like I said, we're gonna offer those elective sessions and office hours for you guys. So elective sessions are like special bonus classes that we've built in for you guys to take advantage of. So we have a self-care lecture, we have a debate movie. So it's a lot of different stuff happening in those evening hours. Office hours are for you guys to connect with your instructors from lab during the day. So say you're having trouble and you just need some one-on-one -on -one support understanding stuff, those office hours are the perfect time to connect with your instructor please, please use it because you do not get that kind of time during the season to do office hours like that with these kind of instructors. So use it to your advantage when you got questions. Office hours are a great way to prepare for your scrimmage debates. Next slide. Lab leaders will provide optional self-guided lessons and the rooms and discords will be to hang out between lessons. So if you have not already joined our discord, um, you can join our discord. I'll share it. Yeah, I will share the link shortly in our chat. So you guys could join our Discord as well. Keep it going. Schedule session breakdown. Sessions are two hours each. There are two sessions a day. Lectures will be recorded so you can plus so you can play slash pause later or down at your own pace. All events will be held on Zoom, Discord, and will be used as a means of communicating and meeting friends. So don't worry if you're not, if you cannot connect, we'll be on Zoom. So don't worry. If you have any issues, you just let us know. Schedule lab time and discussion. So skill building lab time will be a great opportunity for participants to put into practice the skills learned during lectures. Connecting with peers, Uniting three leagues means the ability to collaborate with peers from around California and build connections that last far beyond the end of camp through lab sessions. So this is a great time to jump into the debate community, which you will soon learn is way bigger than the Bay, way bigger than LA, way bigger than Silicon Valley. You guys are literally in a whole networking community now. So in order to get all the resources and friendships you can out of this, those are gonna be those times to network and meet new friends. Schedule elective events. Instructors will be available every evening from 6 to 8 to provide additional assistance as well as have optional events slash discussions to help enhance your camp experience. Below are some of the events. 
So we have a raise your voice for justice. We have a self care isn't selfish. And we also have a movie night. So we got a lot of cool stuff for you guys along with office hours. Next slide. Monday, oh, so yeah. Monday, July 26th from six to seven is gonna be the advanced demo debate slash office hours. And then Wednesday, July 28th from six to seven is the self-care with Brooke. And then Thursday, July 29th from six to 7.30 is gonna be our movie night. So you can screenshot this if you would like to participate in those things, but we'll also be able to show you guys, you know, we'll give you guys announcements, but you can screenshot this for yourself and say, okay, I want to go to this or I remember this. Schedule practice speeches and rounds. On the last day of the Institute, students will participate in a three round scrimmage followed by an award ceremony where the most successful competitors will be honored. The, this scrimmage will be run through tabroom.com. If you do not have a tab room account, we will make one with you prior to the tournament. So don't worry. If, if you've never heard the word tab room before, you probably don't have a tab room account. So that's okay. We're just going to let your instructor know because you all need one to participate. Did you know in our league, students who compete at camp are at least 65% more likely to reach elimination rounds during the season? This is regardless of your win and loss record. Practice, practice, practice. There's no better way to get better at debate than to just do it. It's kind of like swimming. You don't know until you do it. Can't nobody describe it. They can't give you the best advice. You've got to learn how to do it on your own. Next slide. So I know this says tournament, but it is labeled a scrimmage. So don't get all like in your head and boggled by this. This is just a schedule for the day. It is not a tournament. It is a scrimmage. So it's not all the pressures of a tournament. We just want to make sure you understand what happened at camp and you're able to use it during your debate season. So we encourage you to do these scrimmage rounds because you'll be in a safe space with judges from our leagues and people who have been teaching you all week. So we really want y'all to do the scrimmage because there's no way to know if you've retained anything or if you know how to use it. It just dies with you in the corner. So please try to make the scrimmage. This is a schedule for high school. There's going to be a 9 a.m. check-in on the Discord, a 10 a.m. round one um, on the tab room, 12 p.m. is going to be a lunch break, round two is going to be on tab room, and then round three is going to also be on tab room at 3.30, and then there'll be an award ceremony for middle school debaters. Your day is a little bit shorter. Your, your award ceremony will be no later than about 3.30. Um, high school's award ceremony starts at 6 p.m. And yes, middle school and your friends and family are all welcome to attend camp's award ceremony. We want them to come and see y'all. What have you been doing all week? That is when you can show off your glitz and glamour. How to connect for camp. And please let me know if I'm talking too fast. I understand it could be a lot. All sessions will be held on Zoom. Almost every session will be held within the same Zoom link unless otherwise noticed. So you can copy and paste that Zoom link, save it, bookmark it. It'll be the same link. Create an account ahead of time if you don't know what a Zoom is. So I think all of you guys are familiar because you're on Zoom now. But for some reason, if you don't have a Zoom account or have issues, please make one. Create an account ahead of time. Instructions in the email will be in the next slide. And scheduled sessions will be listed on our Google Doc and Google Calendar. So you guys will also have a Google Calendar you can access these links on. How to connect on Zoom. To sign up for your own free account, follow these steps. Visit zoom.us slash sign up and enter your email address. You will receive an email from Zoom and in this email you can activate your account. And there's also a link for the guide that was created by Lambda. I will share this slideshow with you guys as well. How to connect to Discord. Discord this year is meant for community building and relaying information. So if you're part of the Bay Area Urban Debate League Slack, Slack is kind of like Discord, but it's more for gamers. So I'm gonna also post the Slack in, in bottle Slack, the Discord link, but Discord is how you guys will get all camp information and notifications. So if you're ever like, I'm lost or I don't know what to do, you should have downloaded Discord because there's no way for us to communicate. We're not texting you. We're not calling your parents. 
you have to follow the directions and download Discord. If you have issues with Discord, please let us know now. Um, Discord this year, like I said, is for community building and relaying information. To join the Camp Discord, you need to create a Discord account and install the app. Discord is available on your desktop as well as an app on your phone. So whichever you're better with, please download it and you can get access to the channels with this link. Oh, yeah. I can't even link it. Change your, change your nickname on the server to your first name and last name on Discord. So we want you to like, you know, put your name like you guys have now. And then again, the guide to that Discord will be available on Lambda's website. And I'll link that in there. Again, I'll share this information with you all. Our tournament will be hosted on tabroom.com. Go to the website, www.tabroom.com. Click sign up in the top right corner. Register as a non-NDSDA member and fill out all relevant information. On the next window, select competitor. Select yourself, your matching school and name to connect your school. Please screenshot this information. If you have not already created a tab room account, do not have a clue what I'm talking about, screenshot this information, but it will also be available in the email I'll share shortly. Debate questions. Always start with your instructor, always. Please communicate with your instructor any debate related support you need first. So if you are confused, lost or whatever, please contact the person who is working directly with you so that they can help you. If you're not sure who that is, you can contact your camp directors. Once you know your instructor, you can schedule office hours, time for additional help and assignments or topics. So if you need help understanding something, please, please make time with those office hours like mentioned. So hold on. Okay, getting help. Our tech person camp is Quojo with this beautiful background picture. You can also find Quojo in the tech fact, um, frequently asked questions and hashtag tech issues in discord. getting help with interpersonal conflicts. Please attempt to resolve them amongst yourself. Most of the time, it is a miscommunication you can work through. Debates get heated or disheartening. Don't be afraid to take a break, a break if anything becomes overwhelming. Um, know your boundaries is what I could say. Know what you are triggered by, communicate that. And when you are triggered, please communicate that to staff that you need to step away. Debate can get a little triggering because it's communication. Again, everybody do not have the same eyeballs, do not see the world the same way. That's why you guys are debating. You're learning how to communicate. For some serious cases of bullying or you being harassed or any other violations of our community policy, please communicate them to your lab leader so we can address the issue. Anything inappropriate, we're not going for. If you have any issues like that, please immediately contact one of your lab instructors or your lab uh, directors or your lead director, I'm sorry. Getting help with your league reps. If you face an issue that you cannot bring to your lab leader, please get into contact with one of your league reps. So you can screenshot this. Who is your help for your league reps? We got Quojo for Silicon Valley Urban Debate League. We got me, I'm Maya for the Bay Area Urban Debate League. So you got my cell and you got my email to contact me. And then you got Joseph Flores um, for Lambda. And so you guys got his email and contact as well if you have any issues. Suggested materials, what you're gonna need for camp. You're gonna need a computer or tablet. In order to get the most out of camp activities, we suggest you use a laptop, but we understand if you ain't got a laptop. So use a, to use a tablet or you can use a phone. You're gonna need headphones on a microphone. We suggest using a headset for calls for clear communication. So if you don't have headphones or you're having issues with trying to get a hold of some headphones before camp, please reach out to your league directors I know for Bottle, um, the Bay Area Urban Debate League, we're able to send you guys some earphones. So if that's you and you're like, I need some earphones before camp start, I need to know today. So we could go ahead and get those mailed out to you. A quiet, isolated place in your home. We understand this will be difficult. 
You don't really control your household, but try your best to find somewhere quiet that you can be situated. Let your parents know ahead of time you need a space for camp and try to work that out. Paper or a digital notebook. We suggest taking notes during discussion, either with paper and pen or digitally. It's a lot to take in, so make sure you're ready. We look forward to working with you. And if you got some questions, hit us on the Discord. Questions, comments right now on the chat. Anybody? You can just unmute yourself and talk. There was one question in the chat um, for high schoolers. Are we going to be Lincoln doing Lincoln Douglas debate? No. We only do policy debate. I don't think so. I, I might be. I don't think any other camp was running that as far as I know. No. For bottles, uh, Yamin. So this is just for people who are going to be participants in camp. The alumni meeting for questions like that will be on Friday. I'm also sharing you guys a Discord link so you could go ahead and get connected on Discord. That's going to be in the slack in the chat. So if you guys have questions, you can go ahead and hit up that Discord link, save it. Any other questions for us? Okay, then you guys, we will see you Monday and Tuesday of camp then. Thank you so much for participating. Have a great rest of the week. Can't wait to see y'all.